And today, the 2023 annular solar eclipse traveled over southern Utah this morning, giving those watching a celestial show to remember. ABC 4's Annika Johns joins us in studio after spreading her morning in Parowan to watch the ring of fire blaze across the sky. Today, Utahns experienced an annular eclipse where the moon covered 90% of the sun. And for those in southern Utah, it was hard to look away. Happy. Cheers filled the small town of Parowan as the 2023 annual solar eclipse turned the Utah skies dark. The moon is going over the sun. We just saw, what did we see, guys? The, the ring of fire. The ring of fire. <laughs> The moon went in front of the sun and showed us a perfect ring. It looked like a, a orange halo when it happened, but when it didn't happen, it just looked like an orange crescent moon. This annular solar eclipse, known as a ring of fire eclipse, NASA says happens when the moon is at or near its farthest point from the Earth. While other areas across the nation could see the eclipse, those in a small stretch of land from Oregon to Texas were able to see the full ring, drawing those from Utah and beyond. It was something that I came up here for just because um, San Diego is not in the path or not the full path, so I wanted to get as close to home which is evidently Parowan, Utah. Officials with Clark Planetarium say that Utah won't experience an eclipse like this again until 2045. And while those today have a chance to see it again, they say that this is a site you'll never forget. Well, take the opportunity to go find a path of an eclipse and witness it at least once. I think you get to see it like, well, I mean, I think it happens like twice a year or something, but only once every 20 or so years in Utah. So yes, recommend seeing it again. <laughs> this solar eclipse officials are calling a warm up act for the total eclipse that will take place next year. Now, while Utah won't see it over our skies, today's eclipse does give us a glance of what those in the future will see and could see in the near future. Back to you at the desk.